safe landing. Thank you. There's a winch up there at the top that pulls us on. You're at the mark. Since it was abandoned, it was open to the top, so you had birds living in here for like 50 years. So uh, the folks who come in, the first thing they had to do was shovel out at least a foot of guano all the way up and get it cleaned out. And uh, then uh, International Chimney came in because Kennedy, Senator Kennedy, uh, was able to secure a grant to, for restoring the lighthouse. So they redid most of it and uh, uh, redid the tile. So this is pretty much like it looked like in the uh, 1860s when it was done. These towers, uh, the iron mark here, uh, that's original, and that was made in Paris, France. At the top, there's a, a brass placket which says the maker, and it says Paris, France on it. And I guess at that time, France was uh, one of the big iron work stuff from the time of the Eiffel Tower. Mm -hmm. So you could simply uh, order a uh, lighthouse tower based on how big it was and where you wanted it, you'd ship it over and you put it in together. So that's uh, how we got this. It's amazing, it's 1863. Yeah. A lot of what this right in here were fields that they farm so much to raise stuff on. Envires changed a lot here, but I love the nature out here, um, the ocean all around us. I always wanted to live on an island um, in the middle of the ocean, and here, here I was for several years. Uh, George and I became keepers at Thatcher Island um, back in April of 1986 and we had to give it up in November of 1992. The reason we gave it up because we lost the landing ramp in a bad storm. Uh, so there's no way to get onto the island and the Coast Guard had no money to fix it. That was in the days when the Coast Guard uh, owned the island, not Rockport. And I often say, if there is a heaven, it's here on Thatcher Island.